Hello everyone, it's Yvonne here from the Aussie Goddess to do your weekly reading. This reading will span the period of the 26th through to the 2nd of February. It will be for the sign of Leo. Now I'm going to use the Radiant Rider Weight Tarot for your reading. I do want to say please remember that the readings are only general. They may not resonate with everyone. Sometimes they resonate with the cross watchers. So they'll flip back, flip, flop backwards and forwards. Okay, reading for Leo. Alrighty, so we have the Seven of Wands coming up first. Now, the Seven of Wands is the card of standing your ground and defending yourself. Now, sometimes this can be in a little bit of a negative way in that you've become defensive about something, someone or some... Um, opportunity around you, some um, maybe people around you aren't being very fair, there may be a feeling that people are being unreasonable, negative and you are really fighting against this. Um, it can also be a good thing, um, standing your ground, being stubborn, really deciding that you want something and fighting hard for it. Um, whatever this energy is for you, this is about your self-investment. It could be something you're fighting for for yourself or your family, something that you are standing your ground on here because you see some sort of future um, in this. The, the Three of Pentacles for me is always about the cathedral. So it could be you're fighting for a relationship here, trying to make sure that something gets off the ground. Well, there we go. So we have the Three of Swords here. So for some of you here, you're fighting some sort of relationship with someone, standing your ground on a relationship. Um, some interference here from other people. This is why it's creating some sort of some sort of discord. We do have the Nine of Pentacles coming up, so I want to let you know that you're going to come out in front on this. Um, your fighting is worthwhile, standing your ground, um, and standing in your element is really, really important for you right now. Uh, don't give up on this. You are in the right. You are doing what's best for yourself, and you will come out on top. Very nice, Leo. Let's have a look why. Okay, so for some of you, it could do, be do with money. You might be um, arguing with people about how to move forward with a financial situation. Um, I feel like it's, you know, maybe you're making a decision on a person um, to move them into a different situation. Maybe you've got aged parents who need some sort of help here. Um, this is about making the right decision financially to move forward. And it has a very strong bearing here on either a family or a family member. Um, but money is is what the problem is. You've got perhaps others around you who aren't agreeing with the way the money's being dispensed or dispersed. Two of Wands coming out here. So don't give up because you're actually seeing this in the way you want to see it and you have the right idea. So you're focused on the on the right way to go here. Um, other people may not be focused on that because it looks like it may cost them money or they may lose money doing it. So they look, they're very self-focused and you are not being self-focused. You are focusing on everybody's best interest here. You want to take it in a different direction. It is causing a great deal of stress and worry though. Um, because some, perhaps a decision that has to be made is not, um, a, a, a nice decision, um, I feel that you're standing your ground because you know it's the best decision, not necessarily the one that everybody wants to make. Um, I'm getting a very strong feeling that someone here has to put someone into a nursing home or has to make a decision about that. And they're going against the family's wishes, but knowing that it is the best decision to make. You've got people around you who are very focused on the finances here. So they're worried about the money situation, maybe worried about their inheritance. It's causing a little bit of feeling left out in the cold. So maybe you're having everybody else sort of coming against you when you know it's the right decision. Don't give up here. You're about to close it out here. So there's definitely a closing out of some sort of cycle. And everybody's going to be happy with the outcome here, including you. 
that's why I said it's not about getting your way it's about you making a decision that's right for everyone else here I like it a lot okay so we do have the page of pentacles coming in here so there's going to be somebody here who's going to turn their back on you but that's okay whatever this decision is has meant that at least one person has not agreed and will want to move in the other direction with their pentacle. Very strong feeling of inheritance here and inheritance being split across a family. Um, but I feel like for you, you know you've done the right thing. You've stuck by your guns here. And there's the closing out of the cycle. So it will be done. It'll be done. Despite all the worry, stress and whatever else of moving up to this and the continual, you know, fighting for what you think is right, it will be done and you will get the result that you are after because your result is not self-centered. It's not selfish. It's for the good of all. Yeah, look at this. Okay. For some of you, you may be selling a family property or something that other family members do not want to sell. Um, and it is it is the right decision to sell this property. There's no point in hanging on to it, but you've got people who are going against it. They're still going to take their money and run, uh, but you will be fine. You'll be you'll have your portion, and you will know you've done the right thing. It's a very different reading, Leo. Now, for some of you, this could be about fighting for a relationship. Um, because I have this not uh, this uh, King of Swords here, though, I definitely feel like it has a little bit of a legal overtone to it. Um, there could be a situation that is about love, though. And I want to say to you, it looks to me like you are defending yourself and standing your ground on something to do with a love matter here as well. So whether this is love or whether it's a situation that involves money, that people are fighting over money or trying to make decisions about money that aren't in the best interest of everybody, you will stand your ground and you will get people to see your point of view. I do think that somebody's not going to see your point of view though and probably is going to turn their back on the situation, but that's okay. You've done what you thought was right. And it's going to have a very good outcome. Okay, so that when it, the co-create card comes out, I think you are definitely working with the universe on this one. This is not something that's coming from just you. This is coming from, you know, your intuition, knowing what's right, doing what's right for everybody here. So this is about inspiration, fruition and manifestation. Um, it talks about you with your creating your reality and following your higher power here um, and I feel that you're doing this um, you're creating something out of something that you know is the right thing to do you are following your right path I just think you have people who are perhaps more focused on their own needs than the needs of the greatest good but definitely winning out here Leo have a great week